Hey guys, Chris Minge from Revo Group. Here at Revo Group, we're all about revolutions in reliability. To do that, we innovate, we inspect, and we inform. So today I'm gonna to give you a little demo on part of our inspection technology. Uh, our latest bit of kit from Innerspec in the States is the Volta. Now, this Volta is a one-man show. This is the instrument. Now this instrument here, we don't have to touch it to operate it. It fits on this hard chassis on a backpack system. I can wear this on my back. And when I'm in the field, I've got one hand free to uh, hold the tablet and one hand free to drive the sensors. The Volt is an EMAT inspection unit. EMAT standing for Electromagnetic Acoustic Transducer, as opposed to piezoelectric uh, ultrasonics that use a couplant to get the sound into the steel. This one's dry couplant and does a fantastic job of inspecting steel pipes as a fast scanning de device uh, and finding defects that are otherwise hidden from other units. The first function it does is MRUT A. MRUT standing for medium range ultrasonic, ultrasonic transducer, A for axial. It does a full volumetric scan of the pipe and moves it axially. So we're looking at the full wall thickness of the pipe right the way around and we can scan at walking speed for as long as you like. Now we'll move along to the second function, MRUT C, medium range ultrasonic transducer C for circumferential. This is a little encoder unit with a coil and in this case we put a strip, a magnetostrictive strip on the pipe and magnetise that up with a little magnet that we've got in the uh, encoder handle. And then once we've magnetised it up with this little sucker, we roll this around and take a scan and my unit's gone to sleep. And this is, an, this is a representative scan of this pipe. Now I can take it in both directions at once or in this case switch to channel A looking in that direction or channel B in that direction. Unidirectional scanning is a big step forward with EMAP uh, that InnerSpec have nailed. Now this one here, the scan shows the initial pulse on the left and the defects that we've introduced to the pipe on the right. Now the great bit about MRUT C is you don't need access to most of the pipe. You only need about 100 millimetres of access to this pipe. It could be covered in lagging, insulation, uh, concrete pipe supports, corrosion under pipe supports, cups, fantastic. Or this could be vertical going underground into concrete. It doesn't really matter. So uh, there you have it. Cheers.